and hello again YouTube DVD again I know it's been a long time since my last video so my job is taking about all my free time so I can play Gmod as I used to be so today I'm gonna show you something that I've been working on for quite a while now and I'm very happy with the functionality of this thing I called it a maglev spawner here I can choose some models for my maglev here goes the presets I've been using default that's all those parameters I can adjust the mass how big can the numpad force be I can drive my maglev with 8 of 2 and keypad 5 to power it on and also this thing has a lot of boolean variables like if I want enable bone info that will show the information about my maglev module I can uncheck this and there will be no no bone info to block your view also you can update those things so here we have a hail outline which is the the blue outline of my maglev module and I can adjust on the info and update that model override will make my maglev spawner take a different model than the regular ones like for example this barrel now that's now this barrel is actually a Marit module so those are my, my parameters and I've used a forward local and up local vectors what does this mean exactly so I'll show you right now let me just gum so an expression to chip I well known whole 3D which will display my vectors which one was for the vectors Y, the middle one there we have to grab a one maglev module spawn it then the back here as you, as you can see I've got some wire inputs and outputs to control my maglev this is uh, basic functionality by the way I didn't have time to finish this thing on but, uh, but I'm sure uh, I will finish this shit also because I need this thing quite much so as you see on my debug release the reference I set into my Lua code it's 90 and I'm controlling the position of this prop representing my magnet module so I can power this thing on with wire or the numpad so let 
Let's use the numpad for now because I don't want to browse for buttons and because with the power of my maglev I have to press the button which is quite hard. For now I'll stick with my numpad. Let's skip five now. And my pit is doing its purpose. This is all Lua guys. There's no E2. Only Lua code and Lua only. And my process variable is 89.89901 and so on. I can also show you my forward. and right vectors that's forward that's right and that's up which should also be represented right there see let me just bring another whole 3D into but this time I will choose my lovable coordinate system there and go wire advanced from wire link to this let's do it my Mark the spawner again. Here we see we can see the forward vector, which is the local z axis. So my blue one should represent the red. And up lo local vector is my negative forward. As you see my the UCS red big vector is the negative of the blue, blue one right there and to complete, to complete this thing I calculate the right vector by cross product between the red and the blue and ba based on those three vectors I'm controlling my maglev and my pit controller handles this slower code quite nice so I just want to finish this thing I hope I have time to finish this. It's quite nice. And have fun guys. See you next time.